Hi, I'm Terry Donahue. I'm from the Alloy Orchestra. We are a three-person uh, musical ensemble that writes new music for old silent moves, old silent movies, and uh, plays live along with them. Does a lot of recording for DVD releases, and we have CDs, and we uh, been at this for about 20 years. We've done about 30 or so feature films and another 30 or so uh, short films. I'm Roger Miller. I'm the keyboard player in the Alloy Orchestra, where we all compose our scores collectively. We watch, we put the silent film, currently we're just finishing our score for Metropolis. Uh, we put it inside the computer and then we improvise to the film in the computer. We record our improvisations, we discuss them, and then we hammer it out until it's ready to perform along with the film. So it's, we're a collectively composed the scores, which is different from most. And we use a lot of unique instruments. Uh, junk percussion is our sort of speciality. Uh, bed pans and truck springs and horseshoes and pieces of bent metal and cake pans as well as a full drum set. Uh, we also double, me and my, myself and Ken Winnaker who's not here, we double on uh, other instruments, musical saw, clarinet, accordion, xylophone, things like that, banjo, whatever needs to be done to uh, make for the perfect accompaniment to these silent films. The idea happened, I mean, we used to play New Year's Eve in Boston for the first night celebration without film. So we used to have big giant installations of junk percussion, uh, lights and smoking costumes, and it was our once a year show. A uh, film programmer in Boston wanted to show the film Metropolis, which had been restored in the mid 80s with like a disco rock score. And he didn't think that was a very good idea. So he saw us and thought, you know, this would be fun, let's do this for a weekend. And the response was so overwhelming that we just kept on doing it. And um, the crowds got bigger and bigger. Alloyorchestra.com, we got, you know, the calendar, merchandise up there. We have three new DVDs, I think, that are coming out this year, put off by reputable companies. 